Um, it was going to rust. And uh, I'll be very quick, it came out of that yard as good as the day it went in it. It was actually steadier and it arrived on this rally the first time, literally straight out of, uh, out of, uh, rest, uh, out of being uh, left in the yard. It was very good. It just stood for 40 years on its own. And then the fans was going round. That's a... Uh, that's a... That's a...
got a lot of history behind it, that little rally. But, but what, that's what they were used for. A few of them did go aboard for hauling the big guns, but not many because they weren't too good at getting stuck in that awful mud in Florida. But they were useful over here.
Exactly. And another conversion. But we can't we can't say about the bonnet on this one because we ain't got one. <laughs> we haven't done that bit yet then. <laughs> well, remember you've got to do it, you can't see the well. <laughs> now Finn. Foreign tractor. Uh, I think that was German. German to Finn. And one of the things that the Continental tractors have, which we never had, was these things. Seats on the back wings so you could take somebody with you. On the uh, side of it. Many of these were used. It was not that popular as general farm tractors. They weren't that cheap to buy. They were quite expensive. And you didn't have hydraulics, you didn't have electric start, you had to do it all the hard way. So they weren't that popular where they did come into it. Okay.